be more parties out here this morning. Now, we're, we're waiting on the farm to officially open, but I'll tell you, it's been a nice, crisp 55 degrees. The sun is shining bright. Uh, if you have not officially kicked off fall yet, now's your time to do it. And what better time, as we're getting into some of these cooler temperatures, than to come uh, pick out a pumpkin. Now, Southern Bell Farm is actually a family-owned farm. It's here in Henry County, and the uh, Clark family has been here for eight generations. So this is uh, truly a family-run business. This is uh, the epitome of support your local businesses here in Henry County in McDonough. It's a 330-acre, actually working farm. So they do produce pumpkins sitting out here. They're ready. They're ready to be uh, carved, work out in. I don't have time to go to the, uh, the, the fall farm, Felicia. Each pumpkin, on average, weighs about 12 to 20 pounds. So I've got your workout planned for you already. You bring the kids, you grab a pumpkin in each arm, and you walk around the farm because you're definitely going to uh, get your workout in there. Now, obviously, we've got all these pumpkins set out here that have already been picked, and, and they're looking beautiful. Uh, tons of pumpkins just ready for their family, ready to come home. But as we look out this way, this is actually the pumpkin. And then uh, there are so many different things that you could do here at Southern Bell Farm. So we're going to be kind of moving around the farm all morning. We're going to see the other things that are going on behind us, kicking your fall off. And of course, we've got a couple more. Well, you're in the fall spirit yet. If you're not, you came to the right place. Thanks for sticking with us on Weekend Recharge. I'm meteorologist Alicia Combs coming to you from Southern Bell Farms. And we are celebrating all things fall season this morning, this weekend, and all fall. Now, I'm in McDonough, Georgia, which is about an hour south of Atlanta, here at a 330-acre family-run farm that's been in Henry County for generations. The Carter family says uh, they just want to see families come out and have fun and that is what we've been seeing all morning now, I want to show you something uh, now you know most people I think would know what this is behind me uh, two si or what those are two with those silos here at Southern Bell Farms and that is that the corn maze that's one of our popular fall activities right everyone loves a good corn maze follow me over here so you see it here this is a four acre corn maze here at Southern Bell Farms and it's in the shape of those silos that I just showed you now obviously you can't tell that from here, but uh, from up above, you'd be able to tell that that is the shape that we have. It's always a different, unique shape. So say you came last year and you're like, oh, I don't want to do that again. I already know how to get through. Probably not. You can come over here and you can see just how tall these corn stalks are. So if you're like, uh, I can't bring my really tall friend because they're going to be able to see over the stalks. It's not true. They're really tall. Uh, it, this says I'm about five, six, which is about right. So uh, in mood. And let me just tell you that the weather is going to be perfect today, tomorrow. Tomorrow. They're closed on Mondays, but for the next several days across middle Georgia, and we're, we're going to go in there and we're going to see if we can make it through. You do not want to miss that. So stick around, come hang out with us on Weekend Recharge and get in the fall mood. Molly, are you feeling fallish? What do you think? I am. And it is fall with a capital F on Weekend Recharge this morning. Thanks for hanging out with us. I'm meteorologist Felicia Combs coming to you from a farm. Hashtag Felicia at a farm, but we've got all things fall that you might need. The food, the festivals, the festivities, and family. The most important F of all that you're going to have uh, during the fall. So I'm here with the Tilly family, uh, and I've been talking to them a little bit. I'm getting ready to go in the corn maze. You guys just did it. So we've got uh, here have at fun. the Southern Bell Farm, and again. we're going in the corn maze. Guys, uh, if, I, if I get lost, if you don't see me by tomorrow morning, actually, if you don't see me in like 10 minutes, um, there's there's a problem. So it's me, it's Chris Erickson. I told him I was going to run from him, but um, I don't think I'm going to do that. So these stalks are really tall. You can't, you cannot see over them. Now we are in the, we're in the bigger maze. Oh, they're saying wrong way. Hold on. We're going the wrong way, Chris. We got to go, go backwards. Uh, so yeah, uh, we also have a drone shot so you can kind of see where we are. Um, this is, this is, you know, the fun things that you get to do with your family. Now, the longer maze actually has clues that you can try to answer. Hold on, no, we're back at the beginning. Um, <laughs> the longer maze, make a right. Hold on, no, there is no right. You want me to come out? <laughs> this is the opening, guys. You're sending me back to the entrance. 
<laughs> yeah, I know. We're, we're back at the entrance. <laughs> I made it through. <laughs> but yeah, um, so everyone back at the studio guiding me. I'm not trusting your directions anymore. Um, but yeah, we're going to be here all day. So we're probably going to go in there. We're going to try to see if we can actually make it through the maze. But if corn mazes aren't quite your thing, there are a ton of other things to do. We've got the pig races coming up around noon. The pigs race for Oreos. That's all very exciting. Uh, so you came out here and you wanted some lunch. Well, there's a farm market. There's other food that you can have. Great family fun. And it's not just here in middle Georgia. We're in McDonough, but um, you know, you can uh, Google. It has been a perfect fall day on the farm here at Southern Bell Farms in McDonough, Georgia. Thanks for hanging out with us on Weekend Recharge. Now, we've shown you all around the 330-acre farm. Not, not all the acres, but a lot of the things it has to offer. The pumpkin patch, the pick-your-own flowers, the piglet racing, and, of course, the corn maze. Now, I want to bring you to the country market because uh, I think that the comfort food is one of everyone's favorite parts of fall. And here at Southern Bell, farms we have uh, just a little bit of everything that you might want so you can order the food from the bakery and take it out and eat with the on location and that's kind of the hallmark of supporting these local businesses getting out there supporting the fall festivals the um, the the people selling at the fall festivals the local farms like this what I really wanted to show you because what I think is particularly exciting because uh, you know some of these products that you're seeing here from Southern Bell Farms this is quite on honestly what deans which are grapes they've got muscadine cider um, and just a ton of different flavors. So, uh, you know, what you can get here is a taste of your local area, which is so important. Even if you're not in middle Georgia, we're about an hour outside of Atlanta here. There are local farms like this all over that are offering uh, farmers markets like this pumpkin patches. And it's so great to get out there, enjoy the day with your family. And for a lot of us, we're having beautiful weather. So if you're watching today, the weather's been beautiful so far. Uh, tomorrow, it's going to be beautiful here in McDonough as well and across much of the country. So, you know, Molly, uh, it has been so wonderful kind of just getting to explore this entire farm and, and it's really a great reminder of how exciting it can be to switch into a new season and go toward those family holidays. This is really where we switch gears out of summer and go toward Halloween and Thanksgiving and Christmas and uh, everyone starts planning for those kind of cooler months by kicking off fall. Well, the Christmas decorations are already in the grocery store, so we know it's that time of year. <laughs> uh, thank you, Felicia. It's the first weekend of fall. The cow train rides, there are wagon rides. I'm Felicia. We've been hanging out here all day, and it has been a wonderful day. If you're not in the fall mood by now, I don't know what could possibly put you in the fall mood. Now, I will say it is a little warm. It has warmed up nicely after we started out in the mid-50s this morning here in middle Georgia. It's warmed up nicely into the mid -90s. wondering, well, what exactly is behind you? And you can see as uh, a couple, a uh, family gets ready to go get out, support your local businesses, your local farms like this, and get in the fall mood. So, Dr. Postel, uh, Molly, it has been a wonderful day, and you know what? I think I'm ready to slide right into fall right now. I think I'm ready to get on the cow train. That's what I'm thinking, Felicia. <laughs> Thank you.